7 Best Budget 3 Printers Through extensive research and testing, I have put together the list of options that will meet the need of different types of buyers. For more information, I have put links of products in the description. Make sure to check it out. Like the video, comment, don't forget to subscribe, and let's get started. Number 1. Voxelab Aquila When the Voxelab Aquila entered this list in July 2021, it relegated the Anycubic Mega Zero and super popular Creality Ender 3 to the sidelines. Those two are no slouches, which goes to show just how much this little budget 3D printer impressed us. To describe it as an underdog would be misleading, because Voxelab is really the budget sub-brand of 3D printing giant, Flashforge. A wolf in sheep's clothing would be the idiom that springs to mind. The Voxelab Aquila comes in at a comfortable sum under $200, the first main criteria for our top pick under $200. Actually, the Voxelab Aquila trounces this first, all-important checkbox and can easily be found for closer to $150 than $200, making it an exceedingly good value for money for the capabilities and experience it offers. Working with the Aquila is a piece of cake thanks to a bright and easy-to-use UI. You get simple, large icons that leave little ambiguity about what they do. That theme continues in the Voxel Maker slicing software a risk inversion of Flashforge's Flashprint that provides just enough functionality for beginners to get to grips with and produce fine prints. For power users, full compatibility with any G code generating software gives room to grow with the printer. Number two, Creality Ender 3 V2. The Creality Ender 3 V2 is not so much an overhaul of the Ender 3 that came before, more a refinement. Taking the uncomplicated design that served the original so well and sophisticating it with useful additions that make it more workhorse, like and comfortable to use, the Ender 3 V2 continues the series character of balancing high-quality printing with. Here at $262, a competitive price tag. As time has marched on, the Ender 3 V2 ends up occupying something of an odd space. It's a long way from the sophisticated and feature-rich experience that printers approaching $500 will get you. Really, it's just the same Ender 3, but a little extra. It offers the same build volume as our $200 pick. The Voxelab Aquila handles the same filaments, same bed adhesion via textured glass build plate, not to mention 32-bit silent mainboards. They are, on paper, the same. Finding a justification for paying a little more means looking at differences that are less tangible in the prints you will be creating with the printer. For one on, the Ender 3 V2 is a few entries deep in Creality's Ender 3 series which shows there's a refinement here that's missing from the Aquila. Things like tidier cable routing and the inclusion of a tool drawer in the dead space of the printer's base give the Ender 3 V2 a more polished feel. There's also the little fact that Creality's Ender 3 series is remarkably popular countless mods, upgrades, and guides, and we've made a few make the Ender 3 V2 an effortless and logical starter or second 3D printer. Number 3, Creality Ender 3 Zone. The frame may look familiar, but in the Ender 3 zone, Creality changes things considerably from the Ender 3 V2. Listed above, between dual stepper motors to drive the Z-axis movement, the flexible, metal, removable PC-coated print bed, and a sophisticated lightweight print head that introduces a dual, reduction-geared extruder that directly feeds filament to the hot end beneath. The Ender 3 zone is a marked step up on the Ender 3 machines that came before. The $429 price point might seem a little challenging, Given the core specifications of our $200 and $300 recommendations, and the first glance appearance of being just another Ender 3, but there's a lot to be said for the improvements in usability the Ender 3 Sone offers. In addition to a larger build volume, the largest in this list, the Sone Sprite Extruder allows for quick and easy filament loading with strong gearing reducing the chance of clogs and under-extrusion issues. Number 4, Original Prusa A3 MK3S Plus. Prusa Research carved a path with the original Prusa i3 MK2, showing the commercial viability of 3D printers printing essential components to make more 3D printers. Rooted in the RepRap movement and completely open source, its printers stand as exemplars of what an affordable could or should be. Several iterations later, we now have the original Prusa i3 MK3S Plus, a smart and incredibly capable desktop 3D printer that can adapt to its environment and simplify the printing process. The build volume is the smallest on this list, which some may view as limiting, but dual motor driven Z axis with dual gear direct extruder on top of a custom F3D V6 style hot end over a magnetic PI coated print. 
then make the i3M K3S plus the most capable machine on this list. It heats to 300 degrees Celsius, meaning hotter filaments such as polycarbonate and nylon are possible. The setup guides are excellent and give you an excellent primer on 3D printing beyond even the essentials necessary to operate the machine. Should you opt for the build-it-yourself version, saving hundreds of dollars in the process, you'll find a long, budget 8 hours from unboxing to being ready to print. But while illustrated and simple, the follow build that results in no matter your experience in assembling hardware, one of the best desktop 3D printers you'll likely ever use. Number 5 MakerBot Replicator Plus MakerBot has been a pioneer in the 3D printing space for over a decade and is one of the most popular brands for 3D printers today. Their flagship offering, the MakerBot Replicator Plus, a winner of the Red Dot Design Award, features all the connectivity features you will need for ease of use, including Wi-Fi. It also has a full-color 3.5 LCD display with a control dial and an onboard camera to monitor the entire process. One unique feature of the MakerBot Replicator Plus is that you can control it remotely through the MakerBot smartphone app available on Android and iOS. In terms of print quality, it offers a match detail and accuracy thanks to the MakerBot Replicator 3D printing platform. A point to remember is that the Replicator Plus uses a custom MakerBot PLA filament. Number 6. Creality Ender 3 The Creality Ender 3 is a true trailblazer in the 3D printing space. There has never been so much hype for a low-cost 3D printer, and for good reason. It is a device that has been constantly tweaked with customer feedback to create the most bang for the buck and user-friendly 3D printer. In terms of features, the Creality Ender 3 offers a sizable build volume of up to 220x220x250mm and comes with advanced extruder technology that reduces plugging risk and bad extrusion. Another handy feature is the resume printing function that allows you to resume printing even after a power outage or lapse occurs. The prints created by the Creality Ender 3 are exceptional. It comes with open source software which means that you can constantly upgrade the software to improve the performance and efficiency of the device. Number 7. Elegoo Mars 2 Pro SLR Resin 3D printers have become vastly popular because they produce high-accuracy 3D prints with detailed features and a smooth surface finish. The Elegoo Mars 2 Pro is one of the most popular options among the 3D printing community when it comes to SL printers. The Mars 2 Pro features an integrated air filter, a 6-inch screen that can create a layer within just 2 seconds, and a 130x82mm printable area that is enough to print small and medium-sized objects. It is one of the fastest resin printers around and prints highly detailed objects in a flash. So that's all for the today's video for 7 Best Budget 3 Printers. For more information, the links of all products given in the description. Like, share, and subscriber. We'll meet in next one. Bye.